Hey everybody, it's Alana Monique and I'm back for the holidays. I did a gift exchange with Shadeja Pow and it's not going to be what is normally a traditional um, unboxing because the day that the package arrived, I had left town and I didn't get back until yesterday. So that meant that it's been out in the weather um, for about four days soaking wet. Um, when I finally opened it, I actually had to um, throw away two items because um, it was soaked so bad I couldn't actually um, use it. Um, and so she had little notes on them and I, as I was taking them off to dry, I, I read the notes, but I don't know which one the note came on. So I'm just going to show you the things that she gave me and then I will link my gift exchange with her. Um, like I said, anything that was in cardboard or that, um, yeah, basically anything that was in cardboard did not make it. Um, so let me show you the the two items that she gave me that I can't show you, one of them is a box for muffin mix for Red Lobster. How you make them at home. And then the other things were um, cookies that she did for a gift exchange. Um, those two items I had to throw away, like I said, because the cardboard completely exposed all the the, the mix in the bottom of the box and the cookie exchange, I just didn't feel safe eating it given that it was soaking wet. So the other food items that she gave me is uh, Biscoff. It's a European cookie spread. She said that she did like this. So luckily it's plastic and you see I haven't opened it yet. So that was safe um, and I'll try this later. And then this, um, I don't know if you can see all the watermarks all over it, but um, it's actually plastic so it was safe. And this is crisp apple chips and I'll definitely try this later. So those were um, the two food items that I got along with, like I said, the Bisquick, the biscuit mix and some um, cookies or I don't know, something from a food exchange that she got. And then the beauty items, the first one is from LA Girl Pro Concealer and it is in almond. And let me open this up. Has that little brush tip. And she was, um, I, if I remember correctly, <clears throat> excuse me, if I remember correctly, the note was asking if this was a close shade to my skin tone. I could definitely use it as like a highlighter. It's a little lighter than my actual skin tone, but um, I will definitely be doing a tutorial or something with this. And then the package for these was kind of ruined, but luckily the inside seemed like it was safe. And they are the NYX Butter Lip Glosses. Um, they came in three shades, and here it is. Like I said, the package was cardboard, so it didn't make it through the rain. The first one is Devil's Food Cake, and this is what it looks like. Let me open this. You can tell I hadn't touched it yet. Oh, that's a really dark gloss. It's almost a burgundy. That's really pretty. I can definitely do a vapey look with that. The next one is called Red Velvet. And this is what it looks like. You don't want to see my face. That's a deep, and these are really opaque glosses. So that's it right there. You can see it's definitely a red. And then the last is a neutral and it is called tiramisu, my favorite Italian dessert. And this is what it looks like. And this is what it looks like. It's a nice neutral. That's really pretty. And I didn't know that these were so opaque. I thought, I'm not a really big fan of gloss normally because they're so sheer, but I definitely think I could get into these because of how opaque they are. So that's really nice. And then the next beauty item that she got me is from Townhouse French Vanilla Hand Cream. And Oops, way too much. Yeah, I can smell the vanilla now. Okay, that smells nice. Okay, 
can't wait to put that in my purse. Feels nice too. And then the last thing was an African Shea Butter. Is it Taha? This is what it looks like. And it's 100% natural. And it's good for treatment of dry skin, eczema, or minor burns, pain relief from swelling and arthritis, improves muscle relaxation and stiffness, sunscreen due to its rich contents of vitamin E and F, treats dark spots, skin discoloration, stretch marks, wrinkles, and blemishes. I'll definitely try this on my hyperpigmentation. Massages, diaper rash, and as a, I think that's supposed to be hair because it's H-A-R-I, Hari, but hair conditioner. Shea butter does not expire. Store in a cool place. So, it was in a nice container so it was safe from the rain. Oh, that's thick. I've never seen that before. That's really thick. I guess you scoop it out. I have to read more up on this. So that was what I got with my gift exchange with Shadesha Powell. Like I said, I'm sorry it took so long for me to put this up. Um, the day that the package came, I had actually left to go out of town to visit, to stay, to spend the Christmas with my sister in another part of Texas. And so um, coming back four days later, it was on my front door and it was soaking wet. Um, this has been a pretty wet December for. Texas and it's raining as we speak and it's supposed to rain for the rest of this week so <clears throat> I was on the fence about actually uploading the video because I didn't want her to think I didn't want the products or didn't want to show her but I felt so bad that the package arrived late and it got soaking wet and so a lot of the little notes and things were on it but I will definitely leave a link below so you can see what I got her for the little exchange and definitely look for a video for some of the beauty products as I do a tutorial for it. I want to thank you guys again for watching my video. I hope that everyone had an amazing Christmas and I hope that um, Santa got you what you wanted or more specifically what you needed. Thank you again for watching. Know that you're blessed and love, and I'll check you guys out later. Bye.